Hello my dear friends of electronics, my name is Laurent Völkel and in this video I want to talk about TVS diodes. TVS diode and normal diodes actually are both very simple and, and very uh, similar, have two electrodes, anode and cathodes, PN junction. The big difference is not only just on the symbol like you can see on this picture. The TVS diodes are used in the reverse mode. Normal diodes in reverse mode are get destroyed. So TVS diodes are used on propose for reverse uh, to break down because they want to cut away the over voltage. Like you can see in this graph on IV voltage current graph, you can see that the reverse function of the TVS diode is crucial for the breakdown and to make the short circuit to take care of your device or, or, or your uh, component that it does not be destroyed on over voltage. Normal diodes are used like in a rectifier or freewheeling diodes and this is the usage of this uh, normal st standard diodes. TVS diodes are using in the reverse so actually they are blocking the voltage and the current for your device. I will draw you now the current flow on the TVS diode in a normal voltage and when it's in an over voltage. In the operating voltage you will have the current flow from the battery to the load and back. This is the operating normal stage. When you have a surge voltage or over voltage ESD discharge, the voltage will not pass your load. He will run from the source to the diode and come back. In this case, it will protect your device. In this picture, you can see in a TVS uh, uh, rectifier, uh, diodes are taking the voltage and uh, guide them to the TVS diode. In the next picture, you can see now when it's an over voltage position, the diode guides the current through the TVS diode and supreme to the ground. TVS diodes are helpful for ESD. The electrostatic discharge is something which a TVS diode can withstand and it's used for data lines or for different purposes when you want to take care that your device is not getting hurt by over voltage. For ESD protection, TVS diodes are really actually the right solution. You can protect your data line, you can protect your, your sockets, you can protect all the buttons. Everywhere where human body can have a discharge or you have an over voltage protection, you can put that TVS diode. But you be aware, not every TVS diode can um, withstand every uh, surge impulses. For high current surge impulses, you will need a powerful TVS diode. Very important it is where you are placing this TVS diode. Like you can see in this picture, if you place the TVS diode not on the right place, um, like close to the device which you want to protect, uh, the surge impulse or the, TV, the ESD discharge will be already in your system and with the wires you will generate additional magnetic field which can already make a, a destroy effect or something in your device. So it's very important that you put the TVS diode on the right place, very close for the connector, very, very uh, close to the data line where you want to uh, avoid that this current, this voltage is going to your system. What is ESD? I will suggest to watch my other video about ESD basics and hope you enjoy it and you'll learn something about TVS diode. See you in my next videos. Bye bye.